Hi, this is Max with uh, blogtowatch.com and I want to do a quick video review of the Panerai uh, 321. Um, there's also a full review online. So, uh, Panerai, if you are not familiar with the brand, is kind of like a, a you know brand that you know interesting history and uh, originally from from Firenze or Florence, Italy. And um, they they kind of make these watch that have gotten what you could call a cult following um, the Panaristis online, and uh, they they it's you know some people like them I mean obviously love them and and some people don't, but it's it's a brand that I would say it's worth looking at because they um, it might change your mind. Uh, so the one I have in my hand really just got me into the brand big time to a point where like I'm I wouldn't say that I'm becoming like a, a panoristi crazy panoristi <laughs> but I'm certainly a, a, a big fan and uh, so this is the Luminor uh, with the 1950 case um, it has a series of interesting features so first you can see at five o'clock there's this power reserve it has three days works really nice there's the date at three and then at nine o'clock you can see the running seconds um, the case you know one of the things about Panerai is that they make this amazing lumina, l loom on the on the dial and it's made because it's it's done that way because there's like a sandwich dial if you look at the review online you'll see some of the pictures with the loom and it's it's just really amazing um, they used to be dive watches, so you know, with this kind of loom, you can really see it anywhere. You know, if you're diving and you're diving deep. Um, but there are very, very various reasons to like this one. So first thing is, so the case is pretty big, chunky. Um, I think almost 15 millimeter with dome crystal and uh, a very special design in terms of this cushion case. But also, as you can see here, this. Um, device that protects the crown which um, operates very easily by pulling it and then it releases the crown and at this point you can pull it you can grind it of course and then you can pull it and this one is a GMC so when you pull in the first position you can actually turn the hours you know um, one hour at a time and if you don't like the GMT hand you can actually hide it by just covering it that way um, Another interesting feature is that this comes with the in-house Panerai movement, I think P9002, I think. But basically, one of the features is that if you see the running seconds, if you pull it one more, then you'll see the second will zero, so it automatically goes to zero, and then you turn it. And when you turn it this time, you can see that the GMT hands actually does turn as well. So this is how you would set the GMT hand. Um, so very nicely executed, well done, and this certainly a trademark of Panerai um, makes it very recognizable uh, um, as a brand and as a certainly case. Um, on the wrist, it's it's quite chunky as I mentioned, and it comes here with this rubber brand, and I'll talk about the bends uh, very soon. You can see I have a few behind me, uh, and you can see how it fits. It fits. You know, quite heavy on the wrist, but certainly something that you can use, um, you know, as a sport, diving, many different cases. This is 300 meters. Um, but the the thing about Panerai, besides the loom and the legibility, which, as you can see, is very, very nice, um, you know, very easy to read, um, the design very simple, and uh, the case very recognizable, is that it has um, what you can say is this um, easy to use case for you know changing and you can see here I brought a bunch of different straps aftermarket straps and I even have a you know a um, metal bracelet that pretty much converts it into a Panerai 347 uh, but to change it is actually so easy that I'll do it right now and it comes with this little tool where you can 
basically in seconds change the strap and you just pull here pop and then all of a sudden these things come out and then you can take another strap I have the alligator that came with it which makes it very formal a little bit and then some of these straps that I bought online on eBay um, that will completely change the character of the watch and there are just you know really thousands of different options for straps from you know very fancy alligator ostrich and stingray or whatever you want pretty much somebody will sell it to you and uh, you know they range from few dollars to hundreds of dollars to thousands of dollars if you want a very custom version so you can really change the watch and every strap really makes it completely different as you can see so all of a sudden you have a very different watch if I put it in my hand in my wrist you'll see that it completely changes the character of the watch so if you if you're into trying to match you know your strap to how your, your shoes or your belt or whatever you can really have a different watch and it just takes a few seconds so this is another really cool feature of this watch is this amazing changeability and versatility of the watch of course Panerai sells its own set of um, straps like for instance this Astrodomente uh, strap which is very very nice also and it has the deployment buckle here and then of course that rubber one which is very comfortable and makes it into an interesting dive watch um, overall um, excellent watch that really turned me into the brand and I think if you look into this also you will um, you might change your mind if you have an opinion already about Panerai. If you don't, you know, you might become a fan of it. So I'd highly recommend you check it out. Uh, they make certainly different other models, like some with gold cases and ceramic cases and so on. But certainly the steel versions tend to be uh, a little bit more affordable. Uh, again, this is uh, Max for the blog to -watch .com with uh, the Panerai 321. Uh, look for the review soon on ablogtowatch.com and like this video on YouTube if you find it interesting. Thank you.